Here in this video with some sample scala coding and demonstration we shall discuss forming regular expressions in scala. So, here is a demonstration for your understanding. Scala supports regular expressions through regex class available. And this particular regex class is available under the package that is a scala.util.matching and this is a regex, regex class we are having. Regex means actually it is known as regular expression. It is a short form of regex. Okay. We can create a string and call the R method on it. And the Scala implicitly converts the string to a read string and invokes that method to get an instance of regex. To find the first match of the regular expression, simply call the find first in method. So here you see, here we have defined one val pattern and there is a scala dot r. So r is nothing but a method you are calling. So this is the, in this particular method, it is actually scala implicitly converts the string to a restring and invokes that method to get an instance of regex. So now here we are having only uh, one string here. So this is a scala is scalable and cool. So print ln pattern find first in. So the first occurrence of pattern in str it will search. And if you execute the code you can find that it is telling that is a sum scala. So here in this particular string we are having this scala here. So that's why we, it is finding a finite match and that's why the output is coming that is a sum scala here. Just look at the screen. Okay, so it has been explained. Now let me go for the next uh, program that is a regular expression 2 dot scala. Instead of finding only the first occurrence, we would like to find all occurrences of the matching word. Then you can use find all in. In that case, we can use find all in. And method and in case there are multiple scala words available in the target string, this will return a collection of all matching words. So here you see here we are having this scala is scalable and cool this string is having we are having this uh, this particular pattern that is a new regex that is it will start with capital S or it will start with small s and the rest part is C A L A so now when this pattern find all in str when and dot make string separated by comma then this output will be coming like this see here so this particular scala is matching with this scala and also this scalable so that's why it is telling that here you can find that this s is capital and this s is in the lower case and they have got separated by this comma due to the presence of this mk string and string is nothing but a comma there so that will be the delimited with the help of which these particular uh, elements are getting separated in the iterator if you don't use this one if you don't you just omit this one see it will tell that it will it is, it is having a non-empty iterator so non-empty iterator is coming. So if you want to convert it to the string and separate it by the respective uh, delimiter comma, then it will give the output like this. And this color, this S capital means it has the pattern has got matched with this with this part. And here you can find this S is having the lower case. That means the pattern scala is getting matched with this word scalable, because scala is a part of the scalable word. So it will it may have the capital letter or the lowercase letters and rest four letters are C A L A in lowercase. Now let me go for the another program. So if you like to replace matching text, you can use replace first in to replace the first match or replace all in to replace all the occurrences of of the pattern in the given string. So here is the pattern we are having. We have called this R method. So that's why it has become the instance of the regex class and here we are having this string you know, on which this pattern will be searched. So pattern replace first in str java and pattern replace all in str java. So what will happen? This is the pattern. Pattern is our scala. So when this particular scala will be obtained where s can be the lowercase or the uppercase letters and this four letters c a l a will be always in the lowercase and if you search this pattern in this string and th then whenever it will be found then it will be replaced by the java in case of either in case of first occurrence or in case of all occurrences you can find the output like this so here you can find that the first occurrence of uh, scala has got replaced by java 
but here we are having this java has got replaced this scala here and also part of the scalable world is having the scala at the beginning so that has been replaced by java here so in this example in this demonstration we have given you the idea how to use the regular expression in our scala code thanks for watching this video